Hello guys, in today's video we're gonna talk about Shopify, how to create a, a store on Shopify for uh, printable, uh, printable uh, educational worksheets, business, easy and quick. So first type Shopify on the search. First of all, let's enter the website. So as we know, Shopify is a tool for making online stores. It helps people sell things on the internet by creating a website where they can display and sell their product. So first of all, enter here your email address and start free trial. Now you can skip all this if you want and let's continue. Now wait a few seconds to build in uh, the store. first thing you have to do you go to the online store and go to the themes so here you can change your themes and uh, customize them if you want so for example I'm gonna keep this the, the down theme you can search and select whatever you want here just click add and wait to install in the theme for uh, to publish it and customize it on your home page so click here customize and it will take you to your home page store so here the first thing we have here this is the style of your home page you can make it like a desktop or like a mobile style or like a full screen style so I'm gonna keep it just like this this is the settings where you can design your home page store here we have first we have the header the announcement bar you can change the color scheme uh, you can show separation line, you can show icons on desktop, also you can uh, auto change announcements. Uh, if you want to enable country and region selector, and if you want to enable language selector, so that's it. Now let's move on to the announcements. You can change the text uh, here if you want to pass a link or search for something. For example, I'm gonna select all collections. Let's move on to the header. Uh, here this is desktop logo position you can change it uh, you can change the main menu or remove it if you want here the desktop menu type also you can manage it you can change it here you can change the sticky header you can show separate line you can change the color scheme and the menu color scheme uh, here you can edit the you can enable country and region selector you can enable language selector here you can change the mobile logo position you can edit the spacing and the section padding, the top and the bottom. Here you can, if you want to uh, edit your theme settings, you can uh, you can enable uh, search suggestions. Here, if you wanna, you can put your your social media links, your Twitter link, or your Facebook, or Pinterest, or Instagram, or YouTube, or whatever you want to add here. Let's move on now to the header, to the logo, uh, the logo. You have to upload your logo from your library. So, for example, just for example, let's search on it on the browser. Printable educational worksheets uh, logo. So, for example. For example, I'm gonna choose this. So this is just for example. Of course, you have to upload this from your library. So this is your logo right now. You can uh, edit it at any time. You can change it at any time. Here you can edit the vertical offset and the desktop logo width. So that's it now let's get back let's move on to the image banner so here you have the first image and the second image if you want to add the two images here so for example let's search, search on some image on the on the store so for example I'm gonna choose this Uh, here you can edit the image overlay opacity, you can change the banner height, 
uh, also you can show container on desktop you can uh, edit the desktop content position you can edit the desktop content alignment here if you want to edit the image behavior and the mobile layout you can stack image on mobile and uh, show container on mobile so that's it now let's get back and let's move on to the next section here the heading the heading of the, the image banner you can change this just click here and read the text describe what this text is about printable uh, printable educational so like this I can choose from here from these suggestions uh, you can change the heading size so that's it now let's get back let's move on to the buttons here you can change the first button you can uh, change the first button link if you already added the, the, the second uh, image you can here add the second button label and the second button link you can use outline button style so that's it now let's move on to the featured collection so here you can uh, change you can generate the text can change the heading size uh, also you, uh, you can add your description gener generate the description you can here show the collection description from the admin you can change the description style uh, here you can make products for width and you can enable view all if collection has uh, more product than shown you can enable carousel on desktop so that's it if you want to add something new on your home page click here and select what kind of section you want to add on your home page from here so that's it uh, let's move on to the last section on the website the future section so here you can change the color scheme you can show email sign up you can generate the heading here uh, here if you want to enable show on much uh, enable follow on shop you can show social media icons so that's it now let's save this and let's uh, get back to the home page to the dashboard if you don't from design your website let's uh, get back to the dashboard so after you customize your your online store and after you add your first product uh, here you can you add the custom domain and add the sharing detail next step is name your store just type any name you want and here you can add your store phone you can change the, the store email so that's it uh, you can set up payment provider and you can also set your shipping rate so after this after you customize your online store and done from the design and uh, importing your products on your home page uh, the, the only no, only thing you have to do now is launch your online store and publish it so that's it for today if you like this video don't forget to like and don't forget to subscribe i hope this video is helpful for you and thanks for watching till the end and see you in the next video